Beating the drum, lower the flags for a two minute silence. Thank you for coming everyone. Um, obviously I can't help to, do, help to do this as well as Richard would, would normally do this. Remembrance Sunday, we've come along to remember our war dead and also in particular the war dead from South Africa and Rhodesia who in fact when the National Front first started parading here and the official parade wouldn't commemorate them for due to political differences with those countries. Obviously our soldiers were sent off in two world wars fighting against other, other white men brothers wars. They're trying to build up the war with Russia at the moment. Hopefully that won't happen. But just as we paraded past the Women of World War II Memorial just now, I'm sure everyone will have noticed that there was loads of Ukrainians there, many of them, young men of fighting age, who are there almost all of the time demanding that our government do more. Um, obviously we've, we've done enough, we've given far too much money anyway, it's nothing to do with us and, uh, and they should be told that if they want to fight for their country they should go back there and do it themselves. So, um, so thank you very much for coming everyone. Thank you. So we're remembering the fallen from all the wars um, and also in our movement which has been sadly too many recently. Um, Knocker used to always do the security on his um, mother passed away two days ago that's why he's not here. Um, yeah we, we're thinking about them. We're thinking about Ken Kelly, a lifelong so he, he, he came down, he crawled along with his flag. He was totally committed. Nigel Piggins, he was totally committed. We also remember other people like Mick McNeish, skinhead Mick from six, Section 88, he was totally committed. Mike Easter, a long-standing, well-respected nationalist, they have all Past and we do remember them. Um, so I'd like, you know, just a quick thing to say, respect to those gentlemen. And moving on, all those people were activists. They didn't want people stuck in rooms or anything. They wanted people in the streets, and that is what everyone has done today. We uh, is full respect, you know. You've shown there is still some spirit in this country. We still believe in what we believe in. We're here for a reason. We believe in this country, we believe in our race, and we will not give up. Yeah. We will always be here. Yeah. Well said, mate. Well done, mate. Well said.